it might sound a little flowery. Oh, yeah, absolutely. But morning cappuccino makes Craig Bishop's heart sing. It's what you love. There you go. So. Throw that in there. On Valentine's Day. Oh, <laughs> that's great. The coffee shop Sorry. owner wants his customers to feel the same kind of joy. <laughs> love me tender, love me sweet. Compliments of Never let me go. The Thoroughbreds. Heart of my heart. The barbershop group is crisscrossing Louisville, delivering singing Valentines. Can yeah, we, we go out and we, we go from a, like a, an intimate setting in someone's living room and sing to them like we were this morning. And then we went to uh, Aero Hydraulic uh, Place uh, after that and sing to 40 or 50 people and just entertain the masses and have a blast. Sweet and lovely, that's what you are to me. The history of the Thoroughbreds Chorus goes back more than 70 years. And their songs can't help but take you back. I think I know who did it. <laughs> uh, but yes, it was, it was very sweet of them. Sweet? Certainly. And the money raised by the Singing Valentines will help the Thoroughbreds travel this summer to Los Angeles. The groups will come from other countries to compete. And we compete, really, to say who's best. By the way, Craig Bishop didn't just hire the group to perform. Hey, 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 do. He's a member as well. Hey, hey, hey. We do things like we support other charities, even though we are one. Uh, we help with boxes of love, for example. With more than 30 active tenors, baritones, and basses, the barbershop chorus practices and performs year-round. What can make me feel this way? But there's just something about performing on the lover's holiday that does something special to the heart. Happy Valentine's Day, Claudette. Mm -hmm. You're they, wonderful. They just amazing. And they make you feel wonderful and sad and loved. And it's just beautiful music, that's all. <laughs> In Louisville, Jonathan Gregg, Spectrum News 1.